Whenever I can't seem to fall asleep for whatever reason, I do these four things and then I fall asleep pretty quickly. It's actually pretty solid. And the first and last two things of the four I'll tell you are things that you definitely need to do. If you don't do this, then this whole framework won't work. And the second one will definitely help you a lot. I don't know if you need to do it, but especially if you're having problems or if you think you have problems falling asleep, then definitely do it. And I usually do it, honestly. It definitely helps. So all four things are solid. And I'll tell you also why you should do them so you kind of understand because it's simple and it makes sense and it works. So let's just go for it. <laughs> so the first one is that you want to lie completely still. So basically you find a good position where something won't hurt if you lie there for a long time. So I like to lie on my back, set up the things good so I'm not too hot. I don't really get cold, but and so my neck, like the pillow is good and everything. Because if you just move around all of the time, then how are you supposed to fall asleep? Because to fall asleep, you probably want to go into a calmer state. And if you constantly move around, then you throw energy in your body. But it, it, it just makes sense. It's, I don't know the science things behind it, maybe. I don't know if, I think it's true. <laughs> but yeah, obviously, I found at least if I move around all of the time, then I'm not going to fall asleep. At least it's going to take me way longer to fall asleep. So, lie completely still. The second thing is that you want to breathe out longer than you breathe in. Because basically, when you're breathing out, breathing out longer than you breathe in, then you're activating your parasympathetic nervous system. Which basically means that you're getting into a calmer state. It's basically this, the rest and digest system. You can google it up. But basically, yeah, you get into a calmer state. Which, obviously, we want to do. So, this one is a no-brainer. And, if you do it now, if you breathe out longer, then you breathe in. Then, after you do that a bit, you'll realize that, man, I'm actually getting into a calmer state. So maybe do that now. <laughs> and honestly, I don't have a specific time in my head because I kind of just want to get into a calmer state, so I kind of do it roughly. And you'll probably get a feeling if you're doing it right or wrong. But it's actually, when I started, it was actually harder than I thought. It was pretty weird, but it works. So definitely do it. So first, like completely still. Second, breathe out longer than you breathe in. Third, basically you want to focus on your breath. So putting your attention on your breath. Because when you want to fall asleep, you don't want to think about all these other things. You want to get into a calm state and you want to lie still and basically want to calm down and just fall asleep. And focusing your breath is, I found a really good thing to focus on because then you're also present which I don't know if it helps with your sleep, but it just gets you into a calmer state. It's, it's really good. It's, it's kind of a no-brainer because usually when I can't seem to fall asleep, it's because I'm constantly thinking about something. And then when I start to think about something, then maybe I get a bit more energy, whatever. But if I just stop thinking about those things, then I usually fall asleep pretty quickly. So lie completely still, breathe out longer than you breathe in, and focus on your breath. And then the fourth and last one is basically, just like with meditation, when you're lying there focusing your breath, then thoughts will start to come in. And when those thoughts come in, you say, or I say to myself, that I can think about this thing tomorrow, whenever, just not right now. And even if I don't want to think about it later, I'm just like, man, let's just procrastinate this thought. Let's just not think about it right now. Because me thinking about it now won't help me. If I think about it now, then I'll get less sleep, and then I'll be able to think about it worse tomorrow, and my day tomorrow will just be worse. So if it's some problem, or if it's this thing I like think about, or maybe it's someone I'm interested in, then just think about it tomorrow. It's not like it will disappear. Right now, I just want to go to sleep. And of course, when you do this, you don't say, I don't want to not think about the presentation I have tomorrow. Instead, I want to think about my breath. I want to focus on my breath. Because, for example, if I tell you to not think about your kitchen, not think about you walking into your kitchen, and not you think about opening it up and reaching in or reaching in your hand and taking a bottle of water and drinking it, then you're probably gonna think about that. And for me, I've found that that covers everything. So lie still, breathe out longer than you breathe in, focus on your breath. And when you start thinking about things, 
procrastinate them to tomorrow. So say, I'm not going to think about that now and then just go back to focusing on your breath. And then sometimes I fall asleep really quickly and then sometimes it takes a few minutes. But even if it takes a few minutes, then I wouldn't recommend stressing over you not falling asleep because basically when you go to sleep, it's obvious you want to calm down and when you start stressing, then you're getting more energy, but you want to chill. So that also makes sense. So you should, I just think that, oh man, it's like, if I can't fall asleep, then that's okay. I'm just going to lie here and chill. And since I'm kind of in this really calm state, since I'm focusing on my breath and just lying still, then that's the second best thing I could do. Even if I just do that, then I'm relaxing and I'm chilling my body. And maybe it's not as good as sleep, but it's still, it's still the best thing I can do. So I'll just do what I can do and then chill. And then I go into sleep after a bit. So yeah, try it out. Let me know if it works. It will probably work because it makes sense. But yeah, check out this video if you found some value here. Have a good day.